before the year 2000, vitamin D deficiency was typically defined as less than 10 nanograms per milliliter. And that borderline category was defined usually anywhere between less than 12 to less than 16 nanograms per milliliter. Those thresholds used to define low vitamin D, they started to gradually creep up in the literature between about 1998 and 2007. And this was driven by a few key papers. They all share a common author, Michael Hollick. In 2007, Hollick wrote a highly influential paper in the New England Journal of Medicine. Here, Hollick declared that the threshold for borderline deficiency was 30 nanograms per milliliter, and for deficiency was 20. That is really where those numbers, the 20 and 30, got locked in. So we went then from borderline being something like 12 or 16, all the way up to 30, Mm -hmm. right? And deficiency used to be 10, and now it's up at 20. That is fascinating. So I, I see what you're getting here. This is how you create an epidemic. This is a recipe for an epidemic. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. You just move the goalpost. 